Rihanna is one of the most successful female artists of her generation, and she is now one of the wealthiest. When Robin Fenty, known worldwide as Rihanna, launched Fenty Beauty in 2017, she aimed to create a cosmetics company that made women of color feel included everywhere. This vision has helped her to enter one of the most exclusive titles in the world, Billionaire. Rihanna's fortune is now $1.7 billion, according to Forbes, making her the richest female musician in the world. Only Oprah Winfrey is ahead of her in the wealthiest female entertainer list. However, it wasn't her music that made her so rich. Most of her fortune, about $1.4 billion, comes from the value of Fenty Beauty, which Forbes attests she owns 50%. Much of the rest, roughly $270 million, comes from her stakes in her lingerie company, Savage X Fenty. While Rihanna isn't the only celebrity to benefit from her social media presence, she is the most successful entrepreneur to do so. Fenty Beauty, a 50-50 joint venture with French luxury goods conglomerate LVMH, Louis Vuitton, Moet Hennessy, run by Bernard Arnault, the second richest man in the world, was launched in 2017 with a goal of inclusiveness. Its products come in a wide range of color. The foundation is offered in 50 shades, including the darkest shades possible for women of color. Products available online and at Sephora stores, also owned by LVMH, were an instant hit. According to LVMH, by 2018, the first full calendar year, the line was generating over $550 million in annual revenue, ahead of other celebrity-founded brands such as Kylie Cosmetics by Kylie Jenner, KKW Beauty by Kim Kardashian West, and The Honest Company by Jessica Alba. It is estimated that Fenty Beauty is worth a modest $2.8 billion as a part of a rapidly growing industry. Despite Rihanna's success, not everything has gone to plan. In May 2019, LVMH and Rihanna launched a high-end fashion and accessory house, also called Fenty. The brand aimed to broaden the inclusiveness of Rihanna's brand and offer styles in a variety of sizes. However, like many luxury fashion brands, the expensive line suffered during the pandemic, releasing its last collection in November 2020. In a dramatic turn of events, the fashion label announced its immediate and indefinite suspension activities in February 2021. This has still not affected Rihanna's status as a billionaire, and despite releasing her last music album in 2016, just like Kanye West, Jay-Z, or Dr. Dre, Rihanna's exploits have proven there is much more money to be made outside of the music industry. We hope you enjoyed the story. We will be doing more mini-stories in the future. If you did, hit the like button, share, subscribe, and let us know you have subscribed in the comments. Please check out other videos. Please also do not forget to check out the links in the description. Bye for now.